uh, gathering all of the Cobalt Star shards gave the older Princess Rube all of her power back. Uh, fuck. I laugh at you, Mushroom Heads. Pathetic things. You gather the Cobalt Star shards without even guessing the truth. Now I am free. And that horrible, horrible Cobalt Star is no more. I fear nothing now. Do you hear me? Nothing. No, no. So, so the identity of the star spirit that we spoke on the Star Hill was actually the shrewd princess who was trapped inside it. Inside it. Travesty. I will give you a special reward for setting me free. You will love it. And my sister, my dear, sweet, beautiful sister, I will avenge her. I have one thing to say. F fuck. Destroy, destroy, destroy. Welcome to the true final boss of the game. Princess Rube to win sister. Do not be fooled. Even though she doesn't look as big as you know we uh, as she appear as she appeared to be, this thing is not a laughing matter. You want to come in here fully healed with a lot, and I do mean a lot of attack attack items, as well as red peppers. They are going to be your best friend in this battle. So let's do this for the final time. And I mean. I think I was doing like a pretty bad job. Oh, m and this is a really cool mechanic. Uh, Peach is going to help us. Like, uh, uh, sorry, about uh, I was about to stutter. Oh, that was a that was a huge fail. Uh, she's going to help us uh, destroy the saucers because oh, uh, boom! Here we go. God fucking damn it! I'm doing pretty bad. <laughs> Jeez, that was pretty stupid. So she's gonna uh, help us destroy the saucers because uh, they are going to be helping um, the twin sister you know, actually do some damage with them. She has some really cool attacks, and let me see here, I'm gonna go for, uh, for a nice flower. I'm pretty sure that we can also uh, lower her defense. There we go, that was pretty good. And with us having double attack power and, uh, you know, her defense lowered, uh, this calls for a really bad time for her, so let's uh, do this right here. Um, so, when I first played this game, I was, you know, this has been the biggest plot twist since Super Paper, well, on my channel at least, uh, this has been the biggest plot twist uh, since Super Paper Mario, uh, wow, I really wanted to concentrate a little bit, uh, let me see, oh, damn it, I, I thought I was going to attack with Luigi, so we do this right here, ah, oh, that was a pretty fucking shitty attack too, damn it. <laughs> <laughs> but she's gonna do this attack right here. I believe we're not gonna take all that much damage. Uh, jump, jump. So yeah, you want to focus uh, the the hand with which she she throws uh, throws the little uh, uh, wow only eight damage. That was pretty good. Uh, the hand which uh, with which she uh, launched the projectiles. Uh, you want to jump with that brother. Let me see. I want to concentrate a little bit more here. I I'm sorry for you know these final um, kind of a uh, silent. Uh, or like quiet moments, but I I really want to do some damage. Ah, then that was pretty fucking bad indeed. <laughs> Only 300, you know, not pretty bad. We are still, you know, here with Mario. Let's do and well, <laughs> let's hopefully do some massive damage now. Um, I, I I'm really sorry for the quiet moments, but I you know I really want to get this over with pretty fast. God fuck, <laughs> not looking all that great to be honest. <laughs> So for each turn that passes, uh, more saucers are going to be coming here. Please tell. Don't laugh. Please don't laugh. Oh God, fuck! Uh, that was an attack that I forgot about. I'm sorry. <laughs> um, so what she's going to be doing is these, these saucers are going to be, you know, bringing this. Uh, let me see. Do we want? To, there we go. 42, 42, 40. Oh wow, that was some massive damage. That was pretty cool. So more uh, red shells. This is actually your best friend. You can do a lot of damage. Um, right here, you know, after this attack, I'm going to try out the, uh, the, the copy flowers to see, uh, which one we can do more damage with, but, uh, you know, this battle is not going all that bad. Um, god damn it, you know, I, th one moment, I think, I, you know, I'm doing pretty good. Uh, let's see, right here, I'm gonna do some, uh, copy flowers and, you know, hopefully, uh, continue with this, so, let me see. Uh, okay, yeah, we're doing some pretty good damage with this one, you know, with the babies, we're doing pretty good damage, too. Um... 
One thing that I don't really like is that when you use the the red peppers, only Mario and Luigi benefit from it. I mean, it's not like the babies also get fuck. It's not like the the babies also gain, and that was some pretty good damage too. It's not like like, like the babies also gain uh, power up. So please tell me I'm gonna hit it. Uh, wow! <laughs> don't laugh. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. Don't laugh. <laughs> I haven't I haven't even destroyed a single one. So she recovers 120. It's not really all that bad. And boom, uh, go. Oh, that was pretty good. So yeah, don't laugh. Uh, she still has, uh, you know, her defense lowered, and uh, we still have the power up. Uh, well, the the yeah, power up. <laughs> I didn't really know what I wanted to say. So let's do some massive damage as well. <sighs> Why do I always fail? I mean, we, we did. Oh, and her defense is back to normal. I'm, I'm gonna use some ice flowers. I mean, we did 600 and something damage, you know, to to the to to, to Princess Rube, you know, the, the small one. I, I don't really see why. There we go, defense lower. That's pretty good. Uh, I was about to say, uh, you know, a combination of uh, you know, cool and good. So go. Wow, we finally got it, and two for that matter. That was pretty good. So let me see. Oh, uh, this attack is, you know, it's actually pretty cool. Um, so yeah, with. She, she's gonna have a variety of attacks, you know, with, I believe depending on the saucers that, you know, she's gonna have available. Right here, we can stamp with a chomp, and we do not have, uh, double power anymore, so let's go for some more red peppers, and that's pretty cool. So, yeah, another th uh, the, the one thing that I was actually mentioning is that, uh, you know, I kinda don't like how the babies don't benefit from it. I mean, it's not like they do some massive damage. But if they also had a uh, power up, I mean, we, we could do like uh, maybe extra three, four damage, which uh, you know in the long run can be really beneficial. And fuck, I'm doing some really bad work with the you know with the red shell to be quite honest. Let me see. Please tell me I'm gonna hit two again. It looks like I got it. No, only one. Okay, I'm not really you know feeling too bad with that. Uh, she's gonna heal uh, for 120 again. Not really you know feeling all too bad about it. But yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Okay, let me see, so she's gonna do this attack, this one, uh, after a couple of hits, you know, this one is not going to be all that difficult to avoid, as you can see, I didn't take any damage whatsoever, this one is really, really easy to avoid, I mean, when she goes down, I mean, it's, and it's also like, you know, it's not like she does, like, a lot of, um, uh, you know, it, no, 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 not a lot of attack, I kind of forgot what I want to say, <laughs> so let me see, we go this, and this, and I'm also going to be quiet for a sec, you know, hopefully we can do some cool damage. Oh, that was, you know, th yeah, that was better than before, but still. Uh, you know, yeah, the red shells are actually your best friend. Mixed flowers, you know, uh, will come, like, later, uh, because she has another attack that, you know, can indeed be, like, uh, really easy to take care of uh, with, the, uh, with the mixed flowers, so... Let me see. Oh, god damn it, I'm feeling so bad with this one, and she... You know, as you can see, she does have a, a lot more HP than, you know, than the regular uh, Princess Rube, you know, for obvious reasons. I mean, this is, <laughs> this is the plot twist of the game, indeed. So, uh, she's gonna ask for another cool soda, and yeah, I mean... And by the way, if you must know a cool, uh, you know, a cool uh, Chaos Bender channel fact, uh, is that... You know, back in, I believe, I'm not really, I'm not entirely sure of when this game came out, but, um, like... It, it, you know, I think it in, you know, 2006, 2007, 2008 at most. Uh, what I did, I had a little webcam and, you know, I was already, you know, uh, fighting this boss. And what I did, I, you know, I, uh, oh wow, awesome! Boss battle defeated! Plot twist number two. Let's go. This is intimidating indeed. When I was first playing this game, I cannot tell you how scared I was of this fucking boss. When she throws this, the ones who, who do not have fire are gonna go for Luigi, the ones who do are gonna go for Mario, and you really, really wa want to watch out for the order in which she hits the, you know, these things. You... Okay, so Luigi, Luigi, Mario, and then Mario. Let me see. Oh, let's, okay, so this... Oh, wow, this is gonna do some pretty bad damage. Yeah, that's pretty bad. So she's gonna have these uh, tentacles right here. I'm almost dead with Mario, so I'm gonna spend the next turn, you know, uh, giving him like, a oh wow, that, I thought I was gonna fail. 
Uh, so Luigi is looking pretty healthy, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use Max Mushroom with Mario indeed, because we're not looking pretty good. However, the one, okay, yeah, maybe after this attack I'm gonna mention it, so, <laughs> uh, let's continue right here, and let me see, I'm not really sure, I think it's Luigi, Luigi, Mario, Mario, uh, yeah, it is, so, as you can see, we're not doing really good damage to this dude, uh, well, not to this dude, you know, to this girl, <laughs> to this bitch, uh, this attack is a little, you know, uh, difficult to, well, maybe not too, all, all too difficult to avoid, but when she attacks Mario, you know, with her, you know, with her single tentacle, uh, it can be a little difficult to notice, so let's see. Right here, I'm gonna go for another set of red peppers, and this is when the mixed flowers actually come in handy. You will see that we can attack, uh, you know, one, two, three, four tentacles, we can also attack her foot, and we can also attack her leg. If you do not have mixed flowers, this battle goes on for all eternity, and I'm telling you by experience. You do not want to come in here without mixed flowers, and this is why I also recommend the, you know, the ulti free badge. You can use as many as you want. When I was little, you know, I would, I would always go for, you know, the mixed flowers, but, you know, now that I know this game a little bit better, uh, red shells are indeed a lot better, uh, indeed to attack a single item, uh, a single item, uh, you know, a single, uh, target. But when you do this, uh, you know, all of her tentacles are gonna go away, and she can only attack with her, uh, damn it, damn it, okay, there we go. She can only attack with, uh, you know, with her feet, uh, tentacles right here. You know, it's not, wow, I, I swear, I, I can swear I, uh, I pressed B. So, when she, uh, you know, when the tentacles, uh, you know, when, uh, when her arms are gone, what you can do is, uh, now you can use, uh, your, uh, red shells on her feet. And this is gonna bring her down, you know, another, uh, like, uh, like an attackable, if that even makes sense. Kind of on, a, you know, an attackable level, and let me see. Oh, there we go. So, that's what you wanna do. When all of her, you know, uh, her, well... Uh, limbs, <laughs> yeah, of when all of her limbs are gone, you might have noticed that we we're only doing one damage to her. The thing that you want to do, you want to use, co well, either copy flowers or trampolines, you know, something that you can do a lot of damage with, you know, uh, aerial, however, you want to attack her crown. This is much like, uh, Cacleta, where, uh, you have to attack all of her, uh, you know, limbs and, you know, thingies, uh, in order for you to attack her heart. This is kind of the same mechanic with, uh, you know, this Princess Rube. You want to take down her crown, and now you will be able to damage, you know, the... Oh, that was pretty bad. And now you are going to be able to damage her. This calls for... I mean, now you want to do some massive, massive damage, because this battle, you know, the, the second phase, you know, uh, for that matter, it can... I mean, it can go for... Oh, wow, well, that was pretty bad. It, you know, this can be quite lengthy indeed. I saw one of the comments, you know, in my videos, which I deleted. <laughs> God fucking damn it! Wow, that was pretty bad. <laughs> that attack is indeed, like, a little bit difficult to avoid. I'm going to, you know, have a refresh, uh, her, you know, to Luigi, because I really don't want him taking more damage. Since we are almost, uh, <laughs> yeah, we're almost dead. She has a lot of attacks, she's going to be attacking a lot, uh, you know, consecutively. And, let me see, uh, this is gonna go, uh, Luigi, then Mario, and Mar- wow! Luigi, okay, so Luigi's almost dead, I, I should be Oh, uh, if this hits Luigi, this is gonna be bad. <laughs> this is gonna be quite bad. Let me see where... Okay, there we go. Uh, oh, nice, that was pretty good. <laughs> I almost never, uh, you know, I can uh, almost never avoid that. But right here, I am going to go for another set of mixed flowers, not only because we are going to be able to, uh, you know, uh, like, kill all of her, you know, tentacles, because that can actually do a lot more, you know, a lot of damage, like you saw uh, when she grabbed Mario. Um, so right here, I'm gonna go for this right now, and what I was saying before is that this battle can indeed go for, like, uh, you know, for a good maybe 10 minutes or, you know, 15 minutes. Right here, I'm doing some work with the mixed flowers. Oh, well, wow, that was pretty bad. Okay, that was some good damage. Okay, so what I was saying before is that I saw a comment that I already uh, deleted because it was a spoiler. Um, that this thing has like 6,000 HP, and while, you know, we can do some really nice damage with the copy flowers, you know, the red shell, uh, you are going to be, you know, spending a little bit longer, you know, while it is the final boss, so it's, you know, kind of understandable. Damn it, that was pretty bad. 
So her legs are back, her crown is back, which is kind of bad, and please tell me, oh wow, um, not really, you know, not really all that ashamed, you know, of this, I mean, it's the final boss, and I wasn't really all that, uh, you know, I, I didn't really watch out for Luigi, I'm gonna use a 1-up Super, with, you know, Mario still looking pretty good, but yeah, I mean, you are going to be, uh, spending a lot of, uh, time, uh, you know, in this battle, um, even when you are following the strategy that I told you about, and I shouldn't have... Oh, wow, I, I shouldn't have used a copy of... I, I mean, the mixed flowers. I should have uh, potentially gone for the red shell on her, uh, you know, on her feet. That would have been a lot better, but uh, let's continue. So, yeah, this thing has like 6,000 HP. I saw, you know, one of the comments that, you know, was a spoiler. I already deleted. Um, but yeah, you're going to be spending uh, quite a while uh, in this battle indeed. So let me see, this deck is really, really easy to avoid, I mean, you only need to jump. Uh, as you can see in the timing, uh, okay, so her tentacles are back, a uh, bad thing for her is that we are, uh, let me see, yeah, you want to jump with Luigi right there, and you want to also jump with Luigi, so, let me see, what is next? Okay, she's going to have a lot more tentacles right here, so we want to do some good timing, oh, go, 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 go. oh, god, fucking damn it, oh, that was pretty close. So let me see. Now I want to use another set of, uh, you know, um, another set of uh, mixed flowers, and this will hopefully take down uh, both her uh, arms and also her feet, because as you remember, the feet have a lot more HP. With the use of one uh, mixed flower, uh, you know, her, her arms actually go in one hit. But since we already had some damage on her feet, uh, hopefully, okay, there we go. That's pretty cool. So, I'm going to be uh, taking, no, 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 I'm going to be taking the red pep, yeah, I think it is, it, it, it would be kind of good if we took the red peppers here, because Luigi is actually needing it. Uh, after that, I'm going to be using uh, some, uh, you know, the copy flowers, and then hopefully one, uh, you know, ice flower, if I do not get the, um, let me see, that's for Luigi, then Mario, Luigi, and Luigi, so... Let me see, how's this gonna go out? Okay, so I'm gonna use a uh, copy flowers on her crown. Uh, you know, really, really important that you actually target the crown. Otherwise, you know, you're gonna be spending, like, a, a turn uselessly. Uselessly? Is that even a word? I'm not really sure. But let's go, go, and let me see. I really wanna concentrate for this right here. This one is a little easier, you know. Uh, God fucking damn it. Uh. Oh wow, my hand is already sweating a lot. <laughs> okay, so another copy flower on her crown, and hopefully we take it out and do, you know, maybe we can actually do a little bit of damage, uh, you know, to her. Oh, damn it. Okay, so even if you uh, do that, um, she's going to take only one damage, uh, you know, on those attacks. So hopefully uh, we can use a, you know, some ice flower in here, and uh, hopefully can do some massive damage. Uh, like... If you're watching until now, you know, props, because, you know, this indeed, I mean, it, it is really, really enjoyable to, you know, be recording this battle, but I'm not really sure, you know, how enjoyable is it to watch, I mean, I really, really enjoy the, you know, the content that I produce, but, uh, if you guys are enjoying the battle, you know, just let me know in the comments, uh, let me see right here, I'm gonna use a set of mixed flower to get rid of her tentacles, after that I'm gonna use a, um, you know, a nice flower, by the way, you, you, you wanna make sure that you that you make uh, your turns count, because as you see, we do not have a lot of, you know, t uh, time before her crown is back, and, you know, she's kind of uh, immune to our attacks, so, yeah, you, you really want to make sure that our attacks, you know, indeed count. Right here, uh, hopefully I'm going to be using, uh, okay, so, let me see, I'm going to use uh, Ice Flower, and hopefully, uh, you know, have her defense, you know, lowered a little bit, use the babies right here. And, yeah, I think her defense lowered, I'm not really sure, uh, let me see, please tell me, no, it didn't, that was pretty, that was a fucking waste of turn, so, after this, I think her crown is gonna go back, uh, you know, to, to regular power, so, um, you know, I, I, I'm not even, I, I'm not even thinking about, you know, just cutting this battle, you know, even though I could, I'm not even gonna do that, because, well, it's the final boss, I'm, you know, I'm really not gonna do that, <laughs> so, we're almost dealt with Mario, however, um, you know, when she has only two tentacles, it is, like, really easy. So let me see, uh, what should I do here? Uh, I'm gonna go for the mixed flowers, too. I mean, we can, uh, damage both her feet and, you know, her, uh, vulnerable head. So, let me see right here. Go, and... Okay, let's see. Please do this. Uh, we can damage both of those things, and if her tentacles go back, I use another, uh, set of mixed flowers and, uh... You know, just, uh, kill her tentacles in one go doing pretty good with this one. Oh, nice. 
This, I, I believe this has been my, oh, I believe that was my longest, uh, you know, my, my longest lasting, uh, <laughs> mixed flower, I believe. So, let's do another, uh, mixed flower so we can actually take her feet down. And, you know, maybe, uh, chip some more damage. Let me see. Um, I would really like to, you know, just, uh, like, have a turn where she has, uh, you know, uh, her defense lowered. Uh, us having the power up from the red peppers and, you know, maybe do some damage with the copy flowers. I think right here her crown is gonna go back. Okay, you did it. No, maybe, I, I shouldn't be talking because her crown actually goes back to power, um, at the end of her turn. So let me see, this will go, uh, Luigi, Luigi, and then Mario, Mario, and Luigi. So let me see. Please don't. Oh, nice, that was pretty good. Uh, that attacks for Mario, avoid it, uh, then she's going to attack Luigi, and the next one, oh, fuck, her crown is back to normal attack, <laughs> uh, let me see, yeah, so, this is why I was saying that the, the mixed flower and ulti-free batch combo is actually game-breaking, I mean, you could potentially spend all of your money on mixed flowers, I mean, if you didn't find enough beans, and if you don't really want to, um, uh, you know, spend a lot of time. Well, it's not like it's really a lot of time. If you don't want to spend a lot of... Wow, her crown is dead? Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, I should say. Um, so, you know, you can spend all of your money, but you're not really going to have, like, a lot of cash uh, and items. I mean, not that we really, 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 really need them. But, uh, this is one thing that I have always done when I go back to this game and, you know, replay it. So that's Luigi, then Mar... Um, oh, wow, only one HP! What a tank. What a complete tank. So, <laughs> uh, right here with double power, I... Let me see, I... Well, no, because if we use the, the red shells, as you can see, you know, it's, gonna, it's not gonna damage her head. So, when you are in a good position, if you can, you know, have her defense lowered, when you have a double attack power from the red peppers, you could potentially, you know, do some serious damage, you know, with, with everything you throw at her. But, uh, let me see, right here I want to do some, you know, really good chunk of damage, um... Oh, and by the way, one thing that I haven't mentioned is that the music in here is so soothing for this mood. So let me see, that didn't do enough, that, you know, that didn't really do a lot of damage. Copy flowers, so uh, how about the chain chumps? No, I think it's gonna be even the worst. Um, I should actually stick to the copy flowers, I mean, it's not like, uh... Let me see, yeah, this, so just, uh, if you're watching until now, go grab your popcorn, because, you know, this battle is going to, you know, be going on for, like, at least good, uh, six more minutes or so. Let me see, I really want to concentrate for this one, because, uh, god fucking damn it. You know, even though, yeah, it is the final boss of the game, and, you know, but it, it, it does take a long time. It, it's really cool, the music is fantastic. So, you know, another thing that I, you know, that I should also talk about is that, this is actually my favorite, um, like for example, the the music for the final boss in uh, in, in Bowser's Inside Story. It is my you know m my favorite. I mean, it has such a great. I mean, it when you listen to it, I mean, it just feels like really really cool. Oh, and she is back uh, to oh wow, maybe Mario's gonna go down in here. Oh, go 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 go! Please don't attack Mario. Oh, that, that was pretty good. It, it, I'm in between saying cool and good. So let me see, mix flowers to take, uh, you know, everything down uh, with one go. Let's see how long we can keep Mario at 1 HP. That's, you know, that's pretty good. If there was something like a, you know, like a badge, you know, from the Paper Mario, where, uh, you know, something that you could wear, that if you are 1 HP away from dying, I mean, we, we could be doing some massive damage to this thing. I mean, if we, <laughs> if Mario keeps, you know, just keeps at 1 HP, that would be pretty good. But uh, let me see right here, we do some massive damage to all of her limbs, and also her head, you know, with double power. We're gonna go for another mix flower to attack both her feet, and, uh, you know, her head. So one thing that I was saying is that the, uh, final boss music from, uh, from partner, uh, from, from Bowser's Inside Story, that one is really, really good. However, I think my favorite final boss music, uh, you know, it's, it, it, it's actually this one, because it really, really, you know, kinda... Uh, sucks you in this mood of like, uh, you know, you're finding this monstrous thing, you know, that's uh, actually capable of destroying, well, maybe not destroying the world, but, um, you know, yeah, this, this music is actually really, really fitting to this, you know, to this moment, and, oh, wow, Mario's dead, fuck, 
I'm gonna have to waste a turn with oh wow and her thing is back not really all that worried uh, one thing that I would like however is you know just have something that you know could actually tell you how you're doing uh, you know with the <clears throat> with taking down the boss because well right here I believe we are a good like 3,000 damage into this you know into this thing but uh, you know it, it, it really really takes a while and you know it would be really cool to have like a like an HP bar I hope they do that in Dream Team um, Okay, Crown is dead, that's pretty cool. And should I actually waste another turn uh, having a Red Pepper with Mari? I think that's going to be worth it. Um, I don't think the the Copy Flowers, you know, are, are, are doing like some massive, massive... Da oh, wow, shit, I, I was pressing A instead of X. Go. So maybe I'm... Yeah, um, maybe I'm going to stick to the... Uh, uh, God, fuck it. Uh, I am so terrible at dodging those attacks, dude. Uh, so I think I'm right here I'm gonna go for some red peppers again. And, you know, yeah, this battle is indeed taking quite a while, but, you know, hopefully you are enjoying, you know, the mood and, you know, basically, you know, even though I believe that this battle is indeed, like, really, really long, I still really enjoy it. I mean, it's like you are trying to take down this massive thing, and, you know, you know, <laughs> for all reasons, it is indeed the final boss of the game. But, uh, you know, it, it, it comes to a point, you know, when maybe you when you're about to beat her, uh, you know, it comes to a point where, where it could be a little annoying. Uh, she threw another, like, fucking nice. The game has truly been finished now.